Hi, welcome back to my channel. We are in uh, the new game I've been playing, Restaurant Tycoon 2. And uh, if you haven't checked out my first video, go ahead and check that out. It's where I joined the game, learned how to play, and you learn right along with me. Uh, we are up to, I believe, the second day, because it counts down the hours, like 9 a.m., 10 a.m., and during the first day, we learned how to cook a couple of dishes, hired a chef and trained him, hired a waiter. Um, I believe that's as far as we got. So this is going to be the second day. I have not been playing this game off screen, so you, you are learning right along with me. And I do want to make a little, um, add a little warning. It's harvest time here where I am in the Northern Hemisphere, and I am out in the country, surrounded by farms and fields, and one of my neighbors is harvesting today. There's nowhere I can go in the house to get away from the sound. So if you can hear a motor running in the background, that is a tractor or harvester uh, in a nearby field. Maybe it'll just add some atmosphere. Anyhow, let's get started. So I'm gonna go ahead and hit the blue arrow. Daily login reward, $100 in cash. Nice. All right, just like the first day, it's gonna give me a spot to choose. I'm gonna go ahead and load, and uh, the name that I chose, which was Nanistan Nine's Place, for some reason it does the, the uh, hashtag, it, it won't recognize the name, so. But that's the name of my restaurant. Let's go ahead and load that. And there's the restaurant uh, building I chose, which I thought looked kind of Mexican. So my restaurant menu is Mexican food. We can go ahead and click on the menu to view. So far we have starters, nachos, mains, taco. And that's it. That's all we've added. So let's go ahead and go inside. All right. You can see we've already got a couple of customers. It's 7 a.m. on day two. And the speech bubbles, they are getting ready to order. Got some more customers coming in. The chef is cooking. All right, trainee chef, we've got $230 so far. And no diamonds. I don't know yet what you have to do to earn diamonds. But he is cooking. And I think I'm going to go ahead and add another table and chair. And there's the waiter clearing the table. So the way you do that. Oh, I must have accidentally kicked, clicked cook. Well, that was hard to say because it's telling me to cook this meal. So we're making nachos. Swipe up and down on the screen with your finger, and then you cook it. And take it out of the oven, and it is ready for the waiter to deliver to the customers. Now I can also deliver this. We've got a customer waiting, so we went ahead and delivered that. Chef's preparing that last meal. Dishes are collected, so those customers are gonna go ahead and leave. Oh, nope, they're going to order something else. They're both going to order tacos. So they're having double meal. So we'll go ahead and take their order. Now we can let the waiter do it, but I also earn experience points. I noticed um, when our day one was summarized that I had earned experience points for cooking meals and taking orders and all of that. So we can let the chef and waiter do it. Or we can also do it ourselves to help out. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and cook another dish. Let's see what they want me to prepare. I'm going to fry it. I'm going to finish and wrap. And again, for wrapping, swipe your finger up and down on the screen. The faster you swipe, the faster it wraps. And then it appears over here, and the waiter will get it and take it to the customer. All right, I'm gonna go collect my money from this table. 
and I'll go ahead and add another table and chair so we can get some more customers in make some more money and that is under the blue tool button at the bottom I want to add a table and that's the same table that I already have that they gave us to start with so we'll go ahead and add it there you drag it with the arrows uh, the green check mark to place it I don't want another one just the one table and we're gonna close that whoops go ahead and get chairs and the basic chairs again you drag it over you can spin it so it faces the correct direction I wonder if you can make a table for four how much is that gonna oh yeah I'm gonna go ahead and try that let's see if it'll let me do it I'll drag it here spin Spin it. You can only spin one direction. Place that. Table for three created. Yeah, it should go ahead and let me. It's going to be real close to their table, but oh, I can't quite see. Okay, there we go. And table for four created. So, all right, we'll go ahead and close that out. Collect the money because they won't seat any customers until you collect that money. Now we have a table for four, even though there's only two people sitting at it. <laughs> All right, then. I'm going to help the chef out. I'm going to cook. Let's see what we're cooking. Another taco. Finish the wrap. Again, swipe up and down. And it's ready to be cooked up. And we'll cook another dish. I'm going to check in a minute once I finish this dish. Uh, check and see how much it costs to hire another chef. Okay, we're going to go over here and we're going to wrap it. Up and down. All right, so I'm going to go into the staff people button that's the red one all right so to hire another chef is five hundred dollars maybe a waiter is cheaper nope to hire another waiter is five hundred dollars so i spent my money on the table and chairs it was an operator oh okay so you have to have a drive through or delivery all right to order to hire an operator that's pretty far down the line i'm guessing because i only have 132 dollars collected that money let's uh so let's go in and see I wonder where maybe under tools all right restaurant table chairs kitchen bathroom decorations construction let's see what it says so construction walls all kinds of walls we'll go back doors different types of doors roofs flooring there's drive through drive through so it costs $100 to put in a drive through I imagine you have to build a road. I mean, a, you know, a, a, um, a driveway for them to drive through on stairs if we want to build a second floor. What's other? Oh, all kinds of decorations. It looks like walls, streetlights, some stuff that's locked. What's this? glass overhang no we don't want that we'll go ahead and cancel that all right let's see what the bathroom oh yeah bathroom signs toilet sink I imagine you have to put up walls first Wait, let's have that in the middle of your restaurant all right let's go ahead and close that out because it looks like I need to collect some money so we can seat some new customers let's see if we get four people in for the table for four crowds right up against that table the waiters just standing there talking to the customers and the chefs just standing there uh yes we've got four nope table for table for three <laughs> that's good enough i guess let's go outside and check the ratings i'm just curious we're at 7 p.m on our second day 
go right ahead and zoom in on that. So we are at two and a half stars. Food is 2.7. What does it say? Serve at least, oops, serve at least 30 different dishes. Let me see if I can get a little further away from here and get a better view. All right. So serve at least 30 different dishes. All dishes should be cooked using the advanced recipe. Okay. And service is a 2.4. Improve service rating by having high level waiters. Well, the only thing that can raise their level is um, doing their job. So we'll have to wait on that and serving customers fast. I can help with that by helping out with cooking or clearing dishes or delivering dishes. Okay. Design, improve design rating by expanding your restaurant and buying expensive decor. That's not going to quite happen yet because, again, I only have a little bit of money. Popularity. Improved by advertising and also when other players like your plot. Coming soon. Okay. And last but not least, experience. Oops. Customers should be given a lot of space. Oh, oops. Larger tables and background music. Okay. I'm not going to do the background music, at least not yet, because I found on some of my other Roblox videos that I get... Um, dinged youtube doesn't like the background music it says i'm violating copyright laws so okay day two complete rank good one new dish two experience points one dish served two experience points two orders taken 40 experience points four dishes cooked all right so proceed unlock one new dish so we're going to add another dish let's see we have the choice of doing a kids menu item, a taco, or a steak burrito for the regular meal. What a choice. Let's go ahead and add, let's do the steak burrito because I'll bet the kids taco is going to be prepared the same way and I want to see how to prepare this new. New food unlocked, steak burrito, Mexico. Tap to continue. Oh, I'm tapping. Nothing's happening. Might take a minute. Oh, plus one spin. What's that? Uh, no, I don't want to do that. All right, now I'm tapping and nothing's happening. Come, oh, there we go. All right, just a minute. Probably just giving everybody adequate time to read it. So let's go inside and see what's going on. All right, collect the cash. And we have, okay, somebody ordered the steak burrito. So let's see if we can prepare that. Oh, our chef might be preparing it already. We'll go ahead and collect those dishes. Cook. Recipe taco. Okay, we know how to do the taco. So we'll just go ahead and do that. And keep cooking until we see if uh, we get to do a burrito, the new steak burrito. I'm going to collect this cash. Cook. Steak burrito. All right, go to the preparation counter. Chop. Tap rapidly. Oh, okay. Oh, okay, that was easy. And we're going to fry it. Finish it. Okay, this needs to be wrapped too. So we will swipe up and down. All right, we have prepared one of the new items. <laughs> And let's go ahead and finish this last dish and then oh, another steak burrito. So we're chopping something, we're frying it. And then I think we'll call it a day. That was another, or a video. <laughs> that was another full day of business. We added a new dish, made some money, made a table for four. some exploring and found out about our ratings so this game is actually pretty fun it's a little frantic i'm gonna go ahead and deliver that just so i get the points you tap on the you have to actually tap on the speech bubble to deliver it it looks like everybody's happy all right we're gonna call that a day uh next time i think i'll look into building we'll let some money build money uh accumulate and then we'll look into building uh maybe the drive through or the bathrooms, something, hiring some more staff. 
which is actually quite expensive, but we will call that a day. Thank you for joining me. Check out my other video about how to get the restaurant up and running, all the different choices that are available. And I will see you all later. Oops, going to collect my money. Bye!